It may be slow, but it's sure. And it's better to be slow and sure than to be fast and fall. Don't be grieved at your mockers. They can't see what you see. People may laugh you to scorn today, they will celebrate you tomorrow. This could be good for me. Lately, I was feeling. Hi, hi, hi. Good afternoon, guys. Welcome back again to my channel. Guys, in today's video, I want to be making Ogbono and Okra soup recipe. Yes, I'm going to be making Ogbono Okra recipe. So, guys, stay tuned, relax, and enjoy this video. If you have not subscribed, please click on the subscribe button like my video share me out to your platform and all the good stuff guys i'm going to be using snail for more i'm going to be using shaki and dry fish for this ogbono soup recipe i don't know some people they prepare their ogbono without okra i've never done that maybe in subsequent time i'm going to be trying just ogbono recipe but for now for today i'm making ogbono and okra soup recipe Guys, all I did was just allow the meat to boil. I added oil, I added dry pepper, that's Cameroon pepper, yes. I added everything into it, covered it and allowed it to boil, yes, so that the oil can cook properly. After that, I added another seasoning cube. That is the one we are going to be using to prepare this soup. I added salt. Add little salt because Ogbono soup, if salt is too much, hey, it don't cast. It don't cast. So add little. So I added crayfish. That's blended crayfish. Yes. I added everything into this boiled, I mean boiling mist so that immediately I add my Ogbono okra eh the soup is ready so everything is here i'll allow it to boil together before i will be adding my ogbono so this is the ogbono that i just added So guys, this is my okra. I did not pound it all. I just used my grater to grate it. Then used knife to slice some into chunk. Yes, because I love I love seeing chunk of okra inside my ogbono. So I added little water to it. Then set it aside to boil a little bit so that it can give me that sliminess that I need. Yes, if you watch my pepper soup okra recipe you will find out that this was how i still made that okra pepper soup i love steaming my okra separately before adding it up to my soup so yeah i'm just adding my pumpkin leaf to the ogbono soup because immediately i add that okra soup our soup is done because i don't want it to overcook i love when i'm eating my okra is crunchy you get it <laughs> Oh my god, please don't mind me. Oh, give my video a thumbs up, guys. You have watched this part, you have not subscribed. Please subscribe, eh? Share me out to your platform, eh? Thank you guys for always coming back to watch my video. Yeah, I was trying to take thumbnail. Yes, I was trying to take a picture for my thumbnail. That was why I was just posting and I've poured everything into it. Drop your comments, ask a question, and I'll be in the comment section to answer every of your amazing question this is snake ogbono okra soup <laughs> guys isn't it looking yummy at this point guys hmm, let me tell you i forgot to add my periwinkle <laughs> i forgot to add my periwinkle yeah oh, i was already cooking 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 and i forgot my periwinkle and yeah the soup is ready so i just set my parent we go into another pot added sauce boiled it separately then just added it here so that everything can combine together see now guys isn't this soup looking yummy say the truth isn't this soup looking yummy this is yummy goodness Hey God, give my video a thumbs up, subscribe if you haven't, share me out. If you enjoyed watching this video, if you learned one or two, please 
hit that like button eh so that our video can push forward and meet a larger audience thanks for watching guys until we meet again in our next video remain blessed and god bless you mm -hmm. <laughs>